Longevity in the Hollywood industry is easier said than done. Remaining relevant in show business is something that many aspire to go after, but few end up achieving the dream. This is especially true when it comes to child actors. The list of child actors who made an impact on screen and continued that momentum into adulthood is far and few in between. When Parker McKenna Posey was cast as Katie Kyle in My Wife and Kids, her influence was felt despite being surrounded by comedy legends like Damon Wayans and Tisha Campbell. Never taking the shine away from her co-stars, but always delivering her best, that is why Parker McKenna Posey will always remain unforgotten. Parker McKinney was born in August 1995. Her father is black and her mother is white. McKenna grew up in the Crenshaw neighborhoods within Los Angeles County, but now resides in the Valley area. In a 2019 episode of the Where is the Buzz podcast, McKenna said that My Wife and Kids was not only her first role as an actress, but also her first audition. However, according to IMDb, McKenna's first role was a guest appearance in an episode of NYPD Blue in January 2001 two months before My Wife and Kids would hit the air. That same year, McKenna also had a part in Macy Gray's music video for Sweet Baby, which also featured Erica Badu. McKenna was cast as Little Girl. McKenna was five years old by the time My Wife and Kids aired in March 2001. The series would last five seasons and 123 episodes. On the show, McKenna played Katie Kyle, the youngest child of Michael and Jay, played by Damon Wayans and Tisha Campbell. At the start of the series, Katie Kyle was Michael's favorite child, the innocent one that never caused too much trouble. However, as the series progressed, Katie would often get into arguments with her older sister, Claire, and would even manipulate and blackmail her sister in rare instances. Katie would try and turn on her adorable charm to get herself out of trouble. Originally treated like the baby of the family, Katie later grew out of the phase and was given more mature storylines later on, similar to Keisha Knight Pulliam on The Cosby Show. In the third season, Katie was given a boyfriend named Franklin Mumford, a child prodigy who worshipped the ground Katie walked on and thought that she could do no wrong. Looking back on her time on My Wife and Kids, McKenna claims that she was just happy to be on set, but didn't realize the magnitude and impact of the show until years later. First appearing on the show at age five, it's understandable that McKenna wouldn't fully understand the legendary level of actors and comedians she was working with at the time. When the series was canceled in May 2005, McKenna was nine years old. She revealed that after My Wife and Kids rap, she continued to go on auditions but had trouble booking other roles due to the development of her body. I kind of had a hard time because my body was different than everyone I was going up against. I developed around 12. On top of that, I was constantly going up against white girls. Thank God the industry is changing and there's way more opportunities for women of color now and I just love that. But it was hard. After My Wife and Kids went off air, McKenna was cast in the 2005 TV movie Meet the Santas. In 2007, she had a role in Alice Upside Down alongside Nickelodeon child star Allison Stoner. In addition to this, she also had a guest role in one episode of iCarly. Transitioning into adulthood, McKenna was cast as Melody Wright in the original 2016 pilot of the FX drama Snowfall. She was replaced by Rain Edwards when the pilot would go to series. In 2018, McKenna began seeing YouTuber Chris Sales after appearing in one of his music videos. That same year, Sales had gotten a divorce from his wife, Queen Naja, whom he shared a child with. McKenna and Sales would soon become known for their online pranks and skits, similar to the one Sales had started with Naja. The relationship seemed to be going well until the fall of 2018, where it was reported that Sales had been arrested in Houston, Texas for assaulting McKenna. On Hollywood Unlocked, McKenna revealed that the reason why she never spoke about the relationship and incident is because the case was still active. Interviewer Jason Lee informed McKenna that he spoke with Chris to find out about the situation. He said, you all were hanging out and there was alcohol involved and you got out of control and he became the victim. He said there was a lot going on with his son and he felt like he needed to protect himself. McKenna responded, that's a lie and I'll just leave it at that. Let's remove me from the situation. Let's remove him from the situation. Let's just say you guys are drinking or whatever or smoking. That should never lead you to put your hands on somebody. Aside from games people play, McKenna has aspirations of continuing acting in films and working on some music of her own. She has a swimsuit line and as of 2019, she was writing a horror slash thriller script. That same year, McKenna returned to television in a regular role as part of the series Games People Play. The BET drama also stars Lauren London and has been renewed for a second season that has yet to debut. 
It would be the first time audiences have seen McKenna on weekly television since My Wife and Kids. McKenna's hot streak would continue after being cast in the series Ho Phase, appearing in six episodes in 2020 and the web series A House Divided. She joined in its second season alongside Lisa Ray McCoy. In May 2021, McKenna announced that she had welcomed a baby girl calling herself Harley's mom in the captions. My biggest blessing thus far. I love being a mommy. I didn't know what raising you in this crazy world would look like, but I was ready for the adventure. Anytime I had doubts or uncertainties, feeling you growing inside reminded me God chose me to be your mommy. She's currently in a relationship with football player JJ Wilson. The athlete also shared his sentiments on social media. Just when I thought I felt all the love that it was to feel, you blessed me with our beautiful baby girl. I can't even explain how amazing it has been watching you be a great mother to our child. She definitely has the perfect example of a real woman. As McKenna is adjusting to motherhood, she awaits for production to begin on the second season of Games People Play. After being known as the youngest child in the Kyle household, McKenna has blossomed into adulthood with more challenging roles to continue to beat the stigma surrounding child actors. McKenna's performance as Katie Kyle was endearing, charming, and complimented the rest of the cast all too well, which is why Parker McKenna Posey will always remain unforgotten.